In this question part, we are given that the derivative of fx is 6x plus 7. We are also told that f1.2 is equal to 7.32. We have to find fx. Since we are looking for fx and we have the derivative of fx, we'll integrate. So I will write that we are looking for the integral of 6x plus 7 dx. Based on our answer to the previous question part, this integral is 3x squared plus 7x plus c. Since this is the integral of the derivative of fx, 3x squared plus 7x plus c is equal to fx. We have the information that f1.2 is equal to 7.32. Let's use this information to find c. So we can write that 7.32 is equal to 3 times 1.2 squared plus 7 times 1.2 plus c. Let's use our calculator to find c. There are slightly different ways to do this. Here I will start by adding the two terms on the right hand side. So in the calculator I will type 3 times 1.2 squared plus 7 times 1.2 and press enter to get the result which is 12.72. To get c, I will subtract 12.72 from 7.32. Pressing enter once again, we get negative 5.4. Therefore c is negative 5.4, hence fx is equal to 3x squared plus 7x minus 5.4. Let's see an exam taking tip that might help you save time on similar questions. It is that when you are solving an equation on a paper to question, there is no need to show the steps of your working. Simply use your calculator to get the answer and then write this answer down. 